Did you have anything to drink tonight? No. No? No. Okay. Did you have anything to drink tonight? No. No. Did yeah. you, you take any narcotics tonight? No. Did you take any medication? No, I did not. Okay. Do you have any medical conditions I need to know? I do not know. Please don't call the ambulance. Like, I'll, I'll check on you more. That's a now. lot of money, and I'll, I'm not trying to pay that. I'll check on you a little more now, so if you pass out. Okay. Well, like if I pass out, please don't call 911. Like that's so much well, we money. You're 911. You are? Okay, good. Yeah. I can't afford 911 right now. Well, I'll just ask you if you need paramedics. If you wake up, if you don't wake up, then they're coming. I wake up within like 10 seconds, for real. Okay. So it'll be fine. How's it going? Hi, it's good. How are you? The reason why I'm pulling you over is when you made that, that left turn, you turned into my lane. You're supposed to say in your inside lane. Oh, you opened I up right. your lane? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Gotcha. Uh, were, you, were you paying attention? Because you kind of swerved outside in this lane, too, when you turned into here. I was paying attention, yeah. Okay. Did you have anything to drink tonight? No. No? No. Okay. You got license registration proof for insurance. How old are you? I'm 21. 21? You have a current one? Is that not current? Mm, this one's still good. Uh, what's your name? Sada Coleman. What's your current address now? Where are you headed to? I'm just going home right now. Okay. You know where you're at? Yeah. Where at? Where are you at? I'm just heading back north up to Ola I'm on Yamato right now. Okay. Yeah. Be right back, okay? Alright. 4 3, can start 94. Uh, Good. Did you advise that was a Virginia deal? So it says no record found. Ten four. Bravo thirty three, Bravo thirty six, Eastman, Bolt three, one thousand northwest seventeen F, one zero, zero zero northwest one seven F. We have a caller advised they happened to pass by the ten twenty, saw a male lying there face down on the bed. What's your first name? Seda. Seda, can you step out the car for me so I can speak to you? Should I turn the car off? Or? It's up to you. You can leave it on or off. It's on, but it's in park, so. Okay. Oh. I'll speak to you back here, okay? Okay. Um, this license is, it's not coming back to anything. Do you have another license? No. No? Okay. When, um, you from Virginia? Yeah, I'm from my license, but yeah, Virginia. Okay. So look. Yeah. I got a little concerns. Okay. All right. I might have to leave you driving under an influence, okay? Okay. So, based over here, um, I thought she had a friend in the car. She should be fine, but. Um, so, basically, when you when you turn here in the left lane, you're in the inside lane. I was okay. on the outside, mm -hmm. all right? Okay. You had to stay on the inside turn lane. You turn around the outside when you stay in that car. Okay. All right. And then driving here, you're riding this, this, this solid line over here. Gotcha. All right. So, that's my concern to pull you over. Okay. All that's right? fair. So, my concern is I smell some, something on you. I asked you if you need drinks, you told me no. Okay. Right? Did you have anything to drink tonight? No. No. Did you, right. you take any narcotics tonight? No. Did you take any medication? No, I did not. Okay. Do you have any medical conditions I need to know? I do not know. Do you take any
Would you be willing to take take some standard sorority body exercises to swell my alarm that you have been driving impaired? Okay. Okay. Yeah. What does that mean? So basically, I do a couple exercises on you, make okay. sure you're okay to drive. Okay. All right, because you told me you had nothing to drink. Okay. But I mean, if you did, it's fine. Okay. Just let me know because I like honesty. Okay. Did you have anything to drink? A little bit, but not that much. That's fine. Okay. Okay. Um, I'll hold this for a second. Yeah, I'm trying to find your license tonight. They say they can't find the record, so I don't know what's going on. Okay. Well, I'll just double check it, okay? Got you. I'll only move my car back a little more. For a I like to cooperate, so that's I, pre I appreciate it. Yeah, just okay. stay, stay with the Officer Martel for a second. Okay. Turn the back of your car a little bit. All right, before I begin, do you want to, you, you feel comfortable in your boots? Um, yeah, I'm pretty comfortable in them. Because you can take them off, feel comfortable, okay? Because some exercise to do with your feet. I'm comfortable, yeah. Okay. That's good. <clears throat> you just turned 21? Yeah. In March. In March? All right. Yeah. What do you what are you, what are you down here for? I go to school here. Where do you go to school? FAU. What do you do? What are you doing there for? Business management, but I'm on a pre-law track. Pre-law track? Okay. Yes, yeah, so I'm doing law More. school. My stepdad does. Yeah, because I need the lights. Yeah, my. Just offset it with my car. Okay, come come over, stand right here for me. Okay. Right, you can you can stand right there. It's fine. Okay. okay. Mm -hmm. Got you. Just face me this way. Okay. Perfect. All right. This way, like straight forward. Yeah. Okay. All right. What I'm gonna need you to do, I need you to stand with your feet together. Keep your arms by your side. Okay. I need you to maintain this position until you do otherwise. Do you understand? Yes. All right. Um. Basically, what I'm gonna do, you see, you see the tip of my pen. Yes. All right. With your eyes only. With your eyes only, you're gonna follow the tip of my pen. All right. Do you have any contacts? No, like no. in my eyes? Yeah. No. You wear glasses? No. Okay, that's fine. So I'm going to take your eyes to make sure everything looks normal for me, okay? Okay. Just follow with your eyes, with your eyes only, don't move your head, okay? Just like the tip of the pen? Yep. Okay, Ready? got you. Yep. Remember what I said? Just with your eyes only, okay? Okay. Watch out, they're raising us. Maybe. One, two, they're asking for me. Bravo, 43, go on two. Good. Same thing, okay? Yeah. All right. <clears throat> All right. Uh, I'm sorry. What's your first name again? Seda. Seda. Okay. Yes, with an S. Seda. Okay. Seda. Yeah, that gets confused a lot. Okay. Do you see this line? Yep. This white line. All right. Yeah. We're gonna see. We're gonna use this line for me. Okay. Okay. Um, do me a favor. We're gonna use the line. I need you to place your left foot on the line. Right? Put your right heel against the toe of your left foot. Right? Now place your arms by your side and maintain that position until you do otherwise. Do you understand? Yes. Okay. When I tell you to, when I tell you to start, you're going to take nine heel to toe steps along the line and nine heel to toe steps to toe back down the line. On the ninth step, you're going to keep your front foot on the line and turn by taking the small series of steps with your other foot. Okay? Uh, you're going to keep your arms by your side, count your steps out loud, watch your feet, and once you begin to walk, do not stop until the task is done. All right? Nine, you said? Nine. So I'm going to show it to you, all right? Okay. So you're going to have your, you're going to have your, um, your left foot on the line, on the line right heel against your left foot like this, you start in position, all right? Okay. Arms to your side, and you're going to like that, all right? When I tell you to, you're going to take nine heel to toe step down the line. It's going to look like this. I'm going to do three, but I'm going to show you it comes nine, all right? It's going to go one, two, three, Bravo, right? Pretend that's nine step. What you're going to do, the nine step, you're going to keep your front foot on the line and turn by taking a small series step like this, okay? You're going to go back down the line again. One, two, three. You're going to maintain, you're, you're, you're going to you're going to keep your arms by your side. You're going to count your steps out loud. You're going to watch your feet. 
And once you begin to walk, do not stop until the task is complete. Do you understand the instructions? Do you have any questions? Okay, do me a favor again. Go ahead and put your, your, your foot, your left foot on the line. Put your right heel against the toe of your left foot. Right? Okay. You understand the instructions? Nine steps. Okay, go ahead. You want the instructions? Nine steps, that was nine steps. Okay. Remember when I said instructions to go back down the line? Okay. Remember that? Okay. Okay. All right, the next task we're gonna do is called a one leg stand, okay? Okay. Um, go ahead and just face me again. What you're gonna do is I need you, to, you're gonna stand with your feet together, keep your arms by your side. You're gonna maintain this position until you do otherwise. Do you understand? Yes. Okay, when I tell you to start, you're gonna raise one leg approximately six inches off the ground with your foot pointed out, okay? Doesn't you're, matter which leg. Doesn't matter, okay. yeah. Um, you're gonna keep both legs straight, arms to your side, keep your eyes on the elevated foot. While holding this position, you're going to count out loud 1,001, 1,002, 1,003 until I tell you to stop. Do you understand these instructions? Yes. So right. it doesn't matter what foot? doesn't matter what foot. So I'm going to show you first, okay? Same thing. You're going to have your foot, your feet together, arms to your side. You're going to pick whatever foot you want, whatever you're comfortable with, left or right. When I tell you to, you're going to raise that foot approximately six inches above the ground, which they say it's about a Coke, a Coke can size, all right? Okay. So what you're going to do, arms to your side, elevated foot. You're going to look down. Count aloud, 1,001, 1,002, 1,003, 1,004, 1,005, and so forth until I tell you to stop, okay? Um, you remember, while doing this position, you're gonna be hold, holding that position with your foot pointed out and count out loud in 1,001, 1,002 mark, all right? Okay. You understand the instructions? I understand. All right, like I said, you can pick whatever foot you want, whatever you're comfortable and then with. And until you say stop. Yep, are okay. you ready? Yes. Okay, hold on, give me a second. Okay. Just tell me. All right, you can let it begin. 1001, going? You can stop. Okay. All right, come over. Can come over here for me, okay? Uh, you can stand right there for me. All right. No, that's good. Okay. I know it's repetitive, but just go with I, it, I, okay? I understand. Yeah. All right. And what I need to do, you're going to stand with your feet together. Keep your arms by your side with your index fingers pointed out and maintain this position until you do otherwise. Do you understand? Yes. You know what your index fingers are? Yes. This. You know your left and right? Yes. What's left? Left. What's right? Right. Okay. All right. Do me a keep your arms by your side and keep it that way, okay? Just when I point. Yeah, just hold your fingers on like this. All right. When I tell you when I tell you to start, you're gonna close both of your eyes and tilt your head back. When I tell you to backwards? Yep. Okay. When I tell you to you're going to bring the hand I direct upwards, touching the tip of your finger to the, to the top of your nose. After touching your nose, you're going to immediately bring your hand, hand down to your side. Do you understand? Yes. All right, so this is the tip of your nose. This isn't the tip. This isn't the tip. Not your tip. That's your tip. Yes. All right. Um, so when I tell you to, you're going to do left or right, touch the tip mm -hmm. like this. I'm going to demonstrate it for you. Arm to your side, fingers pointed out like this. Your head's going to be tilted back, eyes closed, but mine's going to be open for you just for okay. demonstration purposes, okay? So if I say right, you're going to go ahead, right, touch the tip of your nose, right back down. If Got I it. say left, left, tip of your nose, right back down. Got it. You understand? I understand. Do me a favor, close your eyes. Okay. Tilt your head back. All right, you understand the instructions? I understand. All right. Left.
right. Left. Right. Right. Left. Remember the instructions? Yeah. Okay. So left and right. Yeah, you remember when you're done, immediately touch the tip of your nose and bring it right back. So you all don't right. have to hold it, all right? It's not a big deal, all right? So I know you're in college. What, what level of college are you in? I'm a senior this year. You're a senior. Yeah. Okay. All right. So you know your alphabet? Yeah. English alphabet? Yeah. Your main language is English? Yes. Okay. <laughs> my mom speaks Aussie, but like my main first okay. language is English. All right, well, uh, what, the next exercise is called the Romberg alphabet, mm -hmm. right? Okay. Um, you're going to stand with your feet together, keep your arms by your side, and maintain this position until you do otherwise. Okay. You understand? Yes. Okay, when I tell you to begin, you're going to close your eyes, tilt your head back, keep your arms at your side, and recite the entire alphabet out loud in a slow, non rhythmic manner. You're going to remain in this position until you do otherwise. Do you, do you understand? I understand. All right, so alphabet's not going to be a trick, okay? Yeah. Like I said, is uh, I'm going to show you arms together. Yep. Uh, arms to your side, feet together. I want to tell you, you're going to close your eyes, touch your head back, and you're going to recite the alphabet, okay? okay. It's going to be like this. A, B, C, D, and so forth. You're not going to sing it like L, M, N, O, P, okay? Right, got it. You understand the instructions? I understand. Do me a favor, close your eyes. Okay. Tilt your head back. Yep. Tilt it back. Yep. Go ahead and begin. A, B, C, D, E, M, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, Z. Okay. All right. Uh, next one is called the Romberg balance test. All right. Okay. Same thing. You're going to stand with your feet together. Keep your arms by your side. You're going to maintain this position until you do otherwise. Do you understand? I understand. When I tell you to start, you're going to keep your head tilted back, your eyes closed. And when you think 30 seconds have passed, you're going to say stop. All right. Do not count out loud. Just go ahead and open head? your eyes. Yeah. Okay. So it's going to look like this. Feet together, arms to your side, head tilted mm -hmm. back, close your eyes. You're going to count 30 seconds in your head. You're not going to say it out loud. And when you're done, just open your eyes and say stop. Okay. Okay, I'll tell you when to begin, all right? Okay. All right, go ahead. I think that's 30. 30 seconds? Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Where are you coming from? I'm originally from Northern Virginia. No, I'm talking about earlier. With oh, the wristband, earlier? yeah. Washington, D.C. You came from Washington, you were coming to Washington, D.C.? Well, that's where I live now. I go to school at FAU. Okay, but I'm talking about the wristband. Oh, my wristband? Um, cigar lounge. Okay. Two cigar lounge, like down federal. Yeah. When was the last time you ate? Last time I ate? Yeah. Like, probably 6.30 p.m. I had, like, sorority events, and so I came home at 8, 6.30 p.m. Okay. Yeah. Uh, Alright. Alright. 
All right, do me a favor, put your hand behind your back, okay? Okay. As we're now, you're being placed under arrest for DUI, all right? Okay. Based on my observations, I feel like you're over the, the limit, which is 0.08. Okay. You understand that? I understand. Okay. Can you just start a female for me, Martel? Yeah. All right, you're going to sit here. I'll explain to your friend what's going on, okay? That's fair. Four to three. You can also start at ten seventy one time and uh, available at ten thirty two. Book if you have one. Hey, Hi. a fourth year friend's going to jail for an for DUI. Okay, how much did you have to do? Do you feel okay to drive? To be honest, yes. huh? Yes. Okay. So step out the car for me. Where, where, where are you headed to? Um, back to our place at Winwood. Winwood. Yep. Okay. Let me ask you. You're going to Winwood. Why would you go this way? Um, we just put in directions, so, um... That's what the GPS says? Yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah. We just put in directions, so... Okay. Do you have someone to come pick you up? I can call someone, yes. Okay. Whatever, what, what do you, what documents do you have in here that you need? Anything important? Um, not for me personally, but... Okay. Do you want me to go park it over there? No, we have to tow it, unfortunately. Okay? She shouldn't have been driving. Yep. All right, you guys should have gotten Uber, especially if you live yes, down the street. Yes. Because right, she almost hit my car when she made that turn. As you're going to start with Cigar Lounge, you should have just went straight down 40th. If you're going, mm -hmm. to, if you're going to Winwood, mm -hmm. there's no need to go to Yamato because then you got to take 95 and there's no point in that. Right. There's, okay. Yes, I understand. All right. What's, uh, what's your first name? Whatever you have your documents, it's good. Yeah, um, yeah, I'm good. I'll call for a ride, an Uber or something like that. Mm -hmm. So she's going to jail for DOI. She'll be released in eight hours. Okay. Do you have any questions? Um, what department is she going to? So we're at Boca Police Department. I do my paperwork here and then give me like an hour and a half to two and then we take her up to Palm Beach County Jail. Palm Beach County? Yeah, she'll be released right. in eight hours. Okay. You got everything you need in here? I think so. Do you, can I get her phone out of there? I'll get, I'll, I got I got to inventory the car. So I, I'm going to inventory. Am I allowed to get her phone out of there though? I'll, I'll give it to her. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm going to give it to her. I'm going to give her a property. Okay? All right. Um, All right. You said Palm Beach County? Yep. She'd be going to Palm Beach County Jail. What's your first name again? Seda. Seda? Yeah. All right. So you understand what's happening right now? Yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. Is your friend okay to drive? Um, I don't think so. No? Okay. Could you just like explain to me if you don't mind, like what's going on? So right now you're under arrest for driving under the influence. Okay. Okay. Uh, I guess when you guys were turning at that red light back there, you were next to the officer mm -hmm. and you almost hit him. So that's when. Yeah. So he pulled you over, and then he saw your face, saw whatever expression going on, made his observations. 
that he determined that you might be under the influence of alcohol okay. or, or a drug? That's fine. I, would, I just wanted to know, but that's fine. Okay. You said you're studying law right now? Yeah, I'm in pre-law. I have an internship with a law firm right now, yeah. Okay, so have you dealt with DUIs at all? No, I haven't started yet. I just got the call like a couple of days ago that I got the internship, but mm -hmm. I'm starting on Friday. That's okay. my first day. You said, but you said your father-in-law is an attorney or, or... My stepdad. You're sorry, stepdad. Is, no, okay. you're good. Yeah, he's he's an attorney, but he doesn't practice law. He has his law degree, uh -huh. but he doesn't practice. Okay. So he's kind of the reason that like I wanted to practice just because like no one in my family practices. So okay. I well, figured like I might That's a good well family member to have to be educated. Mm -hmm. Especially right now in the situation that you have, so yeah. eventually you're gonna have to reach out to him. Right. I'd recommend yeah. starting with him and asking him oh, yeah, for, for advice. Sure. He'll be he'll be the first person I reach out okay. to. Yeah. Sorry about this. I know it's like nobody wants to do this on a Saturday night. So I'm sorry. Well, we want to make sure that no one gets involved in a car no, accident. I completely understand. Like, yeah. I'm not mad. Like, I understand. So. so we're not saying that you're under the influence, but based yeah. on his observation and his roadside, all that, everything no, he's done. I'm, I'm not like arguing. Yeah. I completely yeah, understand. Yeah, you don't, you don't have to admit anything. Right. Okay, you don't have to say anything you don't want to okay. say. Okay. Yeah. That's that's because you're in handcuffs. You've already been placed under arrest. Okay. He's going to he's gonna take you mm -hmm. back to the police department. Okay. And he's going to do something with the breathalyzer and yep. then that that's all going to be up to you okay. he's going to have or another officer is going to have instructions and it's going to be clear and concise and you're going to understand before yeah. you answer any questions no i can okay understand yeah all right i'm not trying to argue like no, i know you're you're, yeah. you're being very i know cool the with law this. my my stepdad's in the law so i understand okay yeah but right now we have a female officer on our way out and okay. she's just going to patch you down before we put you in our vehicle okay, okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm taking your phone. Is there anything else in their value? Um, just my phone. Your keys are going to go with the tow truck, okay? You have my keys, my car keys? It's going to go with the tow truck. Okay. Okay. I'll do the, yeah. the, the sheet. Yeah. The only thing that's got my keys in it, but fine. It's just in the door. That's nothing of value, I see. In, in the, oh, I'll find it. Yeah. Do you have any questions right now at all? Okay. I know the law. I'm, okay. I understand. I'm, I'm going to bring your, uh, your registration and your okay. paperwork. We need, when you get the car out, you need it. Okay. So you can show them, okay? Okay. Do you have any questions of the process of what's going to happen? No, I, I think I'm, I understand. Okay. I know the law, yeah. I'm okay. okay. So basically here, you're just being charged with DUI. Okay. Um, we're going to go back to our police station, and I'm going to ask for a breath, right? Okay. If you don't have to, it's up to you, and I'll read you on pipe consent. If you say no, which basically means you say no, you lose by security up to a year. Not a big deal. If I say no, what? If you say no to the breath. What happens? You lose your license for a year. My license? Yeah. Okay. I mean, you can get permits, like work permits or okay. school. But yeah. He's going to read that to you on I'll a formal piece of paper. The process. Okay. So I'll do my paperwork, and I'll tell your friend. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, it's a misdemeanor, but just because it's under the influence, you have to be eight hours, eight hours for your release. So right now it's two o'clock, you release at ten o'clock in the morning. So we do our paperwork at our temporary jail here, and then we take you to Palm Beach County Jail in Maine County. And there I told your friend you should be released around 10, 10.30 in the morning with the court date. Okay? Okay. 44 is on her way. I don't know where she is, but... Do you understand that? Yep. Okay. So each each step is going to be read to you and clarified before you make any decision, saying yes or no to breath tests and all that. Okay. So what happens if I say no to a breath test? Well, they're going to read off a piece of paper and they'll make you they'll let you read it if you want to. Okay. They're going to explain the whole implied consent when you get a driver's license. You're basically saying that if you get stopped for DUI, you have to mm -hmm. get breath. So if you do say no, then you lose your license for a year. Right. Okay. Okay. But That's fine. I just them... wanted to know. Yeah. Okay. But let the, they'll explain it to you again on a piece of paper, mm -hmm. 
in a room with no traffic. I'm Florida license, you don't have Virginia. Did you transfer over to Florida at all? I'm from Virginia. But did you transfer to get a Florida driver's license? Because they say they can't find your license. I transferred to Virginia, I mean to Florida, when I, like last year, a year ago, 3150. Did, did you get a Florida driver's license? Uh, yeah, at the DMV. Do you have one? on you? It's just not on me, yeah. So you're in your Virginia. Okay, that's not good. Okay, that's fine. That's okay, good. yeah. So we can't, because your Virginia was not good no more. Oh, so no, look yeah. It up, I, I got a brand new one when I moved to Florida. Got it, makes sense. Okay. Yeah. Sorry, about sorry about that. Did Come you on. lose it? Where's that one at? No, 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 no. I just, like, got a brand new one when I moved to Florida. But where's, where's that Florida license? Uh, I think it's on my house. Probably. Okay, all right. In my, yeah, I think it's on my house. I just, I probably have it in my car. I always keep my driver's mm -hmm. license in my car. Okay, like that car? Yeah, I should be in that car, actually. Okay, well, we don't we don't need in it right the, now. We'll find, um, we'll find you in our... In the glove compartment. The glove compartment? Okay. Do you mind if I get it in a minute of the glove you, compartment? You can knock yourself out if the car is the car unlocked. Yeah, it is unlocked. Do I need to unlock it? Huh? No, no, we, we have the keys. We'll unlock it. It's the, like, yeah, the compartment. Okay. Probably not, but you're saying it could be in the glove box. Yeah, I'm just helping you out. Your floor deal. Did you get it? You I've been I've been here the whole time. It. Your car's over there, huh? You have the keys to get it, though. I can get you into it if you need it. I, I can figure out how to get in okay. your car. Just if you need it, though, I'll let you know. I appreciate it. Okay. Sorry, this has never happened to me, so I'm trying to be like as like open mm -hmm. as possible. Oh, you want David? I'm sorry? Why, why would you give me this? I, that's the only one I had on me. You know this is a felony, right? Okay. No, I'm not doing anything with you. Okay. Just so you know. I agree. I agree. Okay. My driver's license is probably in my car. We got it. Okay. Sorry. It's Florida. Okay. But that license you gave him yeah. was a felony. It is. Okay. Sorry. You know, fake ID is, right? I'm sure you do because there's one I, right there. Oh, trust me. Okay. My stepdad's in the FBI, so... Okay. Yeah. Well, you're on the wrong track if that's kind of how you're going to behave. The wrong what? You're on the wrong track. Having, okay. having stuff like that. Okay. If you would have told me your real age... I'm sorry? So if you would have told me your real age, I could have gone the other route, right? Or basically I could have done a .02 violation, which means, yeah, you're in 21, but you couldn't blow over .02. Okay. It would have been administrative, this and that. But it's too okay. late. I can't go the other way around. No, I agree. Remind me I, your age. That's fair. I'm not arguing with you. You're 19. Yeah, I'm 19. My real ID is in my car if you want to get it. I think it's in my car. Mm -hmm. Officer Martel, well, we're going to inventory your car. If you find it, he'll give it to me. That's fine. Okay. I'm not trying to argue. I'm taking that driver's license just for evidence. I'm not charging anything to you. Okay, thank you. I agree. No, I'm not trying to argue. That officer's doing you a huge favor. I know. I appreciate Like a massive it. favor. I appreciate it so much. Okay. I'm not trying to argue. Like, seriously, I... No, listen, no, no one's even no one's scared. even going that route with you thinking you're arguing I'm with them. I'm just scared, so... Okay. That's why I'm trying to cooperate as much as I can. Like, I'm so okay. sorry. Are you gonna call my stepdad? Um, no, you're an adult, so we're not gonna call anybody. If you were under 18, we would. Not very long. 
you like it or no? I like it. Is this like what you've always wanted to do or like? Since, since day one. Really? Oh yeah. Are you from here? Yep. Where are you from? Right here. Like Boca? Yep. Oh. I'm not from here at all. From Virginia. Okay. Where in Virginia? Like Northern Virginia, right outside of DC. Like uh, Fairfax. Yeah, Haymarket. Loudoun. You know where Loudoun County is? Yep. Yeah. Loudoun County is like right next to Fairfax. Okay. Huh? What kind of Hyundai? Yeah, what is it? And what kind of car? A Hyundai what? Hyundai Kona. Kona. 2019 Kona. Where in Loudoun County were you at? You know, like, I'm from Aldi. It's a really small town. But, like, you know Sterling? Oh, yep. Yeah, it's right by Sterling. Okay. But nobody ever knows where Aldi is. Hmm. Yeah, but I'm from Aldi. My parents just moved there because, like, they both work for the government, so it's, like, closest yep. to them. But that's just where I grew up. Okay. So, yeah. But you, you know, like, you're familiar with that? I've been up there before. Oh, okay. Yep. Do you like it or no? It's beautiful. Not as nice as down here, though. I like it better up there. Really? Why? With all the four seasons? Fall? I don't know. I don't like the seasons. I like the beach. You'll, you'll get sick of it. You'll really? want to go back up there. I don't know. I've been here a couple years and I really like it, so... Give it time. Mm -hmm. Hey, was, uh, is, uh, what's her name going to come here? Or no, she give up. Because Westway beat her here by like 20 minutes, so. Yeah. Aquaphor? Yeah. Like mouthwash? Like for or my that lips. Toothpaste? Like chapstick? Or no? no. Okay, that's fine. My lips are so dry, I don't know why. We have to deal with that. We'll give you some water when you get to the police department, okay? I don't think water will help. Mm. I need like aquaphor. We don't have any. We that's can't okay. provide that either. Don't lick your lips because they'll get worse and dry. I'm trying. Hi there. Morning. Just give me a minute. I'm gonna work on the the slip for you. I appreciate it. You guys can't be that busy. You got here in like five seconds, so. Oh, well, that's because I was just hiding right down the Were road. Were you? <laughs> and as soon as I decided to go use the restroom at uh -huh. the gas station across is when you guys called me, I was like, all right, well, I'm just gonna get this. Right she must have been following us. Because like as soon as I'm pulling into the gas station, I go back up. I look down the road, <laughs> and I was like. Ah, uh, I feel like I'm about to get a call. And <laughs> no sooner did I finish that thought, I was like, "That's funny." <laughs> Guys have been very um, low key this week. Well, today actually, no, last night. <laughs> huh? I'm, I'm trying to jinx it. That's actually what I'm trying to do. Oh, today. don't do that. I am intentionally trying to jinx it. <laughs> They're waiting for our, uh, our female officer to get here, and then I'll work on that sheet. And, uh, uh, meanwhile, though, are you guys done processing the car? Or is it uh, I'm not going to process but i got to look in it and just do the inventory real quick. Um, there's not much in there, um, according to him, so it'll only take me like a couple and minutes. And the key for it, is it still in there? The key, this should be on top of the roof or in the car. I don't know. He, he knows where they are, but they're, I just they're not with her, and they're not only with him. Okay, let me, I'll, I'll ask them. Let me secure that key first before... Oh, okay. Oh. Just, yeah. Then you're all set. Yeah. I still gotta do a sheet for you though, so. Oh, right, never mind. I. I think you just have the greatest partner. Yeah. Right like, I think he's got the worst partner right now. <laughs> well, then, if that's the case, then I'm going to hook that car. Perfect. Right? Thank you. And get ready to go as soon as I get that sheet. Perfect. Right Appreciate here. it.
How long was she hitting one for? Like 20 minutes? 30 minutes? Huh? Yeah, I think she hit Why you got here quick? Here? Yeah, she's pulling behind you. Next to you. I told Graham I was going to get him the rest, I got one, so he wasn't dinner. Huh? Oh, okay, so, sure, yeah, of course. Come over here, Harrison. Oh hey guys, I'm gonna do, huh? Why is that printed out? I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I need to grab it. Awesome. Anything that's going to poke me, prick me, hurt me, stab me? No. Nothing sharp? No. No needles or anything? Okay. We're going to be taking all this jewelry off. We'll put it all in a bag for you, okay? Okay. You guys got a bag? Yeah, I couldn't find it. No, you're good. I don't have any pins in there. You know my chance to have sandals in the car, do you, or just those boots on you? Oh, these are the only things I have, sorry. Everything. You're just going to need to take it off anyway. So. That's fine. Shorts underneath these? No, sorry. Your underwear? I'm sorry, yeah, I'm not. Don't be sorry, I'm just asking. Okay. People wear multiple layers of clothing. Not me. Mm. I'm like a fainter though. If I see blood, I'm gonna pass out. Just so blind. Okay, as long as I don't look at it, I'll be fine. I've tried to get my blood drawn, and like they don't know. They just told me that it's in my mind. Please don't call the ambulance. Like, I'll, I'll check on you more. That's a lot of money, and I'll, I'm not trying to pay that. I'll check on you a little more now, so if you pass out. Okay. Well, like, if I pass out, please don't call 911. Like, that's so much well, we money. You are 911. You are? Okay, good. Yeah. I can't afford 911 right now. Well, I'll just ask you if you need paramedics. If you wake up, if you don't wake up, then they're fine. Any 
piercings that we can't see that you have on you? Just your yeah, nose, right? Just my nose and my ears. Nothing else? No. All right, just have a seat, and then just one by one, I'm going to take uh, your shoe off. Okay. So start with your right one. There's a zipper on the inside. Just leave in your socks as they're gonna take off anyways, alright? Okay, that's fine. And this one. There. You got grips on the bottom. Oh, so. this one. You like country music? I do. You want to listen to it? Yeah, I love it. I'm in a lot of trouble. I can tell you that this happened to people and they get out of it. I mean, this person been arrested and it's kind of like a first offender thing. This is my very first time. My brother's been arrested for it personally, so I know what he's been through. Okay. And he's always got his good job and everything, so there's nothing. Okay. My stepdad's a lawyer, so. Like I said, just because you're. Just because you're being charged with it doesn't mean you're guilty of it, right? You still have your due, your due process in court. Right. I don't take anything personal. I don't care. It doesn't bother me. Okay, thank you. Right. Thank you. I appreciate that a lot. I'm just, like, a little confused, but okay. I'll explain everything to you. Thank so, you. If you told me that you're under 21, I could have gone a different route, right? Right. But you told me you're 21, it's just... I can look at your license and nothing can come back. Right. I just didn't, I don't think I have my license with me, which is why I was saying that, but you're right. That's well, completely my fault. I'm not, I, I, yeah, no, 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 I'm not blaming you. I'm blaming me. Like, you're right. You're 100% right. Yeah. But I'm pretty sure my real license is in my car. I didn't find it in there, so. Oh, you didn't? No. Damn. Okay. I'm, like, I'm not blaming you, though. I'm seriously not. Like, I know the law. Trust me. Like, my dad's in the FBI. Like, I know how it I'm is. I'm taking that license. I'm not going to put it in. If I would, if I'd have put in a report, then technically I'm going to be charging you with that. So I'm not doing that to you, okay? Thank you so much. I really appreciate that. That's very nice of you. But, like, I know, I know my real ID. I have a picture of it and everything. I found it. Oh, you did? Yeah. Okay, good. I'm glad. I'm so sorry. All right. This has never happened to me. And my mom told me if anything happens, she's literally pulling me from school, so I'll probably be... Why, why didn't you guys Uber? I'm sorry? Why didn't you guys Uber? You're down the street. Because I already had my car there, and I was... I'm I'm just... I don't know. I wasn't thinking, if I'm, I'm sure being your honest. Your mom, your dad, your stepdad told you. They always tell me. And my mom, like, she has her credit card there. She's like, if you ever need to Uber, like, use my credit card. Honestly, like, I'm going to be completely honest. I was just being stupid. And I, I regret it now, obviously. Like, I think it was so dumb of me. Like, I should have just Ubered. I wasn't being smart. I wasn't thinking. But, like, I have an event at 8 a.m. tomorrow. So I was like, I have to have my car at home. And then I just wasn't thinking. 
So, like, 100% I take responsibility. Like, it's all my fault. I, I 100% know. I, I'm not looking for forgiveness. I'm not looking for, like, whatever. But, I like, I want to take full responsibility. I know it's my fault. I'm not trying to argue with the police. I do love Morgan Wall. <laughs> Are you from around here? Yeah. Like born and raised in Boca? No, like my mom. Oh, that's cool. What made you want to come to like do work in Boca? Alright. Yeah. I'm not from here. I'm from Virginia. Yeah. yeah. My friend's from Pennsylvania. We met a couple years ago in Ashland. Yeah, I, school's like the number one thing for me. It's always been number one for my family. Like, the only reason I can go to school here in Florida is because of scholarship, like from my school and stuff. From high school, like, I got really good grades in high school, so that's the only reason I could, like, afford coming to Florida. So I'm really grateful. So I'm just, like, trying to keep that GPA up. And, like, I have an internship right now with a law firm. Like, I want to be a lawyer. Hey, what's, what's the phone number for you? A phone But, yeah. I love, like, law and, like, stuff like that. You're still 5'3"? I'm sorry? Are you 5'3"? My height? Yeah. Yep, that's my height. I'm a few away. Like, probably... Oh, I'm single. Hair color? Hair color, brown. Eyes? They're, like, hazel, brownish, green. Hispanic or no? No, I'm not. Are you Hispanic? Yeah. Oh, really? Where? I'm half Cuban. Okay. My mom's Ozary. You know where that is? I don't. Azerbaijan? It's, it's like the bordering country of Armenia. Okay. Yeah, the Kardashians are from Armenia, but my mom's from Azerbaijan. It's like the bordering country.